Today we're going to start creating a paper bag owl. So we're going to do two things. We're going to take this two-dimensional paper bag, meaning flat, and then we're going to open it up and create a three-dimensional owl. And we're also going to add some stripes, some lines across it. So you're going to choose the kind of lines that you want and draw it on the bag. Once we have all the lines on here, then we are going to use some bunched up paper towels to fill up our bag. We're just gonna rip some small pieces and crumble them up and then fill that whole bag. You also wanna make sure your bag is open all the way. So I like to make sure that the bottom here is completely flat so it can stand up while I fill it. So I'm just going to fill it with a few of these paper towels right now. At this point, you're gonna find the crease in the two sides of the bag and push it in before closing it. Like this. And then to make it look a little bit more like an owl, we're gonna fold the two corners down. So first we'll just fold it down like this. And then we're gonna take the two corners and fold them down here. And it sort of gives it more of an owl-like face when you fold it down. So I'm going to use a little bit of glue to close it. I'm going to put a little bit of glue right here on the inside and then also inside the fold and then I'm going to do the exact same thing on the other side and then when you fold it down it kind of gives it that sort of angry owl look so I'm going to put a little bit of glue under the center too now not only am I going to glue it, but I'm going to take some feathers and stick it in the corner and then glue it down. So I'm going to pick two feathers and just place it under the corner of each side and then use a stapler to secure it in place. So obviously a grown ups can be helping with this step. Okay, and then once it's stapled, we're just going to let it dry so that the next time we're together, we can add the features of the face, the two eyes and a beak and some wings. 